Hello guys, in this video I want to share with you my experience with painting with oil paints and using Evolve Artist Academy. And if you know me for a while, I usually uh, draw and paint uh, digitally, so I most of the time use the iPad these days and then I can always print out the artworks and I love working with color and uh, basically you can achieve that in digital or traditional form. Let me hold this up, these two, so you can see the, the comparison as well. Sorry, that's not the right artwork, this one, <laughs> this. But anyway, in this video we will be talking about the exercises you can do in this artistic program because that will... great. <laughs> Okay, let me remind and attach this painting exercise properly. Okay, I attached two more washi tapes here to this um, oil painting exercise. And clearly this washi tape is not the best, so I need to get better washi tape. But uh, what I wanted to mention before we dive in into talking about Evolve art program is that I haven't used oil paints that much in the past. If I draw traditionally and paint, I usually use a gouache or acrylic and I like to use very loose paint strokes when I'm uh, basically drawing animals or landscapes or I use maybe pastels and I try to combine different media. So basically I'm using mixed media paintings or mixed media techniques when I'm creating art. You might be asking why oil painting when I'm usually painting digitally, but even when I paint digitally, uh, my artworks are based on traditional media techniques or the learnings from those. And also when I create classes and brushes to paint digitally, I want to basically experience and have the knowledge of different traditional medium or media. <laughs> That's how you're supposed to say it, right? Um, I need to know how these mediums behave and how you paint with them. So I decided to learn more about oil painting and oil paint is more challenging uh, medium to master, I think. So what is better than learning from people who have a lot of experience with this? And this led me to the Evolve Academy, uh, Artist Academy program, because they have more than 30 years of experience. And after seeing some of the artworks from other artists who went through the program, which are just amazing. Uh, I decided to give it a go and I think it's always good to expand your skills and basically never stop learning. And I also interviewed uh, Kevin in one of my old interviews, if you saw that, and I learned more about the program. So I was happy that uh, they sent me the first module to try so I can show this video to you guys. And this video is not sponsored and all the opinions are my own. So I was always more motivated to paint directly with color and light, not only with black and white values, but in order to understand the colors and create more realism and basically the colors that you would like to achieve in your art, basic exercises using uh, simple shapes and just values, you know, black and white, helps you immensely with improving your art. So I think they are very important um, to kind of achieve what you want with your color art, basically using the colors. So I was super happy to see that the exercises are there in uh, Evolve Artist Program and you go methodically step by step and you have all the instructions that you need going through all of these homeworks 
and this is just one of the exercises that I did. What I also find very interesting and very helpful in the Evolve Artist program is that opposed to some of the very fast paced uh, learning art programs and art making, Kevin and his instructional videos help you to go through the exercises at your own pace. So basically taking your time to create precise brush strokes with intention so you can achieve the results that you want. And as I said, all the videos and instructions are pre-recorded, so you have a lot of flexibility to watch the videos and do the homeworks and exercises at your own time and basically pace as you need. Another point which I find very important or it was important to me is that the oil paints you work with in this program uh, don't smell and basically when you paint your homework assignments and use the paints and basically have them open they don't smell as uh, you would maybe expect at least I was expecting that and because you don't mix it with any chemicals you use oil to mix the paint which is great if you maybe have animals at home or at, or kids so it doesn't bother the, the whole environment you work in and you don't have to have a special separate studio but anyway you always want to keep the paints and tools out of reach of animals and children so keep that in mind but anyway just a little <laughs> disclaimer so i found it great that the paints don't smell what I also really like about Evolve Artist Program is that they send you all the tools and materials that you need for completing each module so you don't have to go search for too many additional extra things before you start making something. And uh, I really like the materials because they are high quality materials so they help you create things and you don't have to struggle with them. But I recorded a nice unboxing and I like to watch unboxing videos as well so maybe you as well so let's just jump into that. All right, here is the box. It feels quite heavy, so I'm excited to open it. Let me get some tool to open the edges. Oh, what I really like right after opening the box is that it's not filled with plastic to protect the tools. So we actually consider the environment. This is a huge plus for me. Okay, and now let's look at some of the first things here. Okay, so what you get in one of the first packages that you receive for a first blog is an eyedropper, so you can uh, sample the linseed oil in a precise manner and you get the texture that you want with the paint. Then you also get the palette knife. And there is also knitting needle, one for block two. So this is not for block one. You also receive grayscale paint set with four tubes, which is of course essential for practicing painting and mixing paint and basically everything. <laughs> and you get the set of four colors uh, ranging from lighter gray to mid-tones to darker gray. And the paints that you get are the old Holland paints with a great quality, so it helps you to achieve the results you have in mind much easier. And based on my research, in 1664, various old Dutch master painters established Old Holland and now the brand still uses their recipes to make the colors, but with a new technology. And now a lot of professional artists and professional restorers in more than 50 countries use these paints. So, well, it sounds like that you are in good hands using these colors. 
There is also paper ruler, one for block two. Then there is linseed oil to mix the paint. And uh, this is great that there is no chemical and you can actually use the linseed oil, which I don't think it smells. So this is a great bonus for me. Then you also receive Evolve brush set. And these are great quality brushes. They are synthetic and they are the brand Old Holland. So yeah, you get to paint right away with great quality brushes, which helps the learning process. Then there is also palette paper pad. And this paper pad is grayscale, as you can see, and it has 40 sheets and you can use this palette for oil or acrylic paints as well. Uh, then there is also reference packet where you have 17 sheets of grayscale photograph, so you can practice with those. Uh, also, there is a checklist packet where you have six sheets of checklist to help you with your assignments and your progress when learning. Then you also receive example sheets, which you can use for your projects and exercises. Uh, you also receive transfer paper, which is like a transfer packet and this one has like 19 sheets uh, so you can do line drawings also there is a canvas pad so you have a awesome paper to paint on so you don't have to paint on uh, something which uh, you might not use later on and you get three of those canvas pads So that's it. And there are a few additional things uh, which you might already have at home if you paint or you want to get is easel, a board to tape your painting to, a tape, paper towels, and that's it. And even though I often enjoy using very loose shapes and just play with color, I think the exercises where you learn how to create a laser sharp edges and how to control your brush in the right way are very helpful. I also really enjoyed the explanation and exercise on how to use the brush with oil paints and how to create those laser sharp controlled edges in your art and how to create clean lines with different brush strokes. So basically you create edges and brush strokes exactly how you want them and where you want them to be in your art. Because this is especially useful for realistic paintings with a high level of detail and lots of blending. So you can create shapes and shadows exactly how you want them to be, for example in portraits or landscapes and basically anything you want to paint. And this exercise from the class will help you to achieve that. Because Kevin shares variety of techniques, how you can control your brush to basically make the brush strokes exactly how you want them to be and how to achieve uh, the results that you are looking for. And you can watch the videos uh, while Kevin is explaining the techniques and you can rewind them while you are making the homework. So I usually ended up having the computer on one side, playing the instructional videos, and then I was painting on the other side of the table. And to master your skills, more time and more practice is always beneficial. So I decided to do another exercise just to practice more precise brush strokes. And I did a painting of two cats from one of the reference images, which is meant for a later assignment to do the gradient and more volume. But I decided to use this reference 
just as another bonus exercise just for myself so these reference images are super helpful also if you want to practice more in addition to this what i also found helpful from one of the videos from kevin are the tips on how to approach bigger artworks if you can't finish it in one sitting and you want to avoid the paint to dry out. So you have a lot of helpful tips and tricks in the program. The gradients making technique with oil to create a smooth and realistic transition that Kevin is sharing in his videos was very interesting and it was very helpful to watch Kevin explain and demonstrate how to create a nice gradient using different values. And the tips he shares in his instructional video were very interesting because I haven't used this technique yet and how Kevin organized his palette for this exercise made the process so much smoother and easier in my opinion. And also the technique of mixing the additional values for the shading is making the process much easier without much confusion in my opinion as i said so this palette technique is very nice and i think blending oil paints perfectly and evenly definitely requires quite a lot of practice so that would be something i would need to uh, improve on and practice more uh, if i go to the realm of using oils every day and I think in this exercise I didn't have maybe a perfect paint uh, or kind of the paint texture. It wasn't as smooth, so I probably added slightly more paint than uh, it was said in the instructional video. But other than that, the palette technique that Kevin is sharing in the videos is very helpful. As I said, and uh, I use similar approach with other traditional media like wash and uh, also digital art. So I really like this exercise overall. Another great point which I found very helpful in the videos were actually the videos where Kevin explains and shares the tips and tricks how to keep your brushes in the best condition possible for a long time. So you have also videos about cleaning brushes and oil paints and uh, that point I basically didn't know so I found those videos very helpful too. In addition to all the learning, there is also community feel, so you can hang out with other students on the group calls which you can join and you can also see the other people's homework. So you can compare the same subject, which I think is a great additional kind of value to this program. So you are not creating your assignment in a silo, but you are part of the community doing the same thing as you are. And after every exercise, you can get the custom feedback, which is super helpful on your way to success and the progress in your art. And your feedback on the website appears super quickly, just overnight. So I can continue and basically you can continue with some new insights on your homework. And this approach in the professional art school is not only about oil paint, but it's also helping you to get a better artist step by step with variety of exercises. And uploading the homework into the system was also very easy and straightforward and I didn't have any issues with that, which can happen with some systems, as you can imagine. And you can also book a call with your instructor and ask specific questions one on one, which I think it's great and uh, get new experiences and insights that way. And you can also easily book the time with your instructor in the system by just looking at the available time slots and selecting the time and date that fits you the best. So I found that one also very flexible. And let's also talk about uh, who I think this program is not for, because of course, not every program and learning experience is for everyone. So I think this program is not suitable for people who are not willing or able to uh, give time to learn and basically put aside the time to make the exercises and the effort into learning new things. 
because there are a lot of assignments and homework to help you to master your craft. And basically, if you don't have time or willingness to put the time into the art making, this program might not be for you. Okay, those were my main points about Evolve Artist Academy. So whether you are a newbie or you already have some experience with art, I believe the Evolve Artist Academy is a great value. So you should definitely check that out. And I wouldn't be recommending this course if I didn't believe in it and also seeing the amazing results of other people as well going through the course. I mean, just look at them. Some of these examples are just after one year of joining the program, going through the transformation. I mean, aren't they amazing? Yeah, my mind just stops basically <laughs> looking at that. So uh, anyway, I can't recommend this program more. So you can sign up with the link below and I can't wait to hear your thoughts. So you can comment below and I'm also looking forward to see if you join the program, your art and your progress in artwork. So thank you so much for being here and see you next time. Bye.